Hello and welcome to another update video about mana. I think we see a very bullish formation currently forming and I think we could see a breakout in the very, very short, um, well, in, in the very near future. So, you know, re remember we obviously did go up to all the way to $5 in a blow off top, came down within minutes, back to, <laughs> to uh, 350 or something, uh, even a little bit lower. We then consolidated in this descending um, channel pretty much a bull flag that we can see here. Now we have broken out of that bull flag, but we didn't see the volume yet. As you can see, the volume is declining. If the volume is declining, that indicates we could be in a triangle formation where this, the price is just squeezed uh, you know, into an apex of a triangle where people are waiting for something to happen. Um, so eventually, yes, that was probably a bull flag, but we didn't really see that massive breakout that we would or I would have expected. Um, one reason for that is that we are still massively overbought um, on the RSI. But uh, what I want to show you really is that why I believe a breakout can happen very, very shortly. So we can identify one trend line here now. Yeah, I mean, this is n we have various touch points on that trend line. I think it's a valid one. Normally, I'd like to have another touch point. But then again, if you have too many touch points, Everybody knows that trend line and the trend line becomes weaker. So I'll move that into, put another color up now so that you can see it a bit more clearly. So that blue trend line here. Now we can also identify another trend line, I think. And uh, that, that trend line could, it's not 100% clear, but I think it could be somewhere here. Giving us three touch points here on those wicks yeah uh, on those candles so we've got one touch point here another one there third one there indicating that we're currently consolidating actually in a symmetrical triangle which is a trend continuation pattern and i mean you can clearly see what the trend is here right so it's an uptrend and this is a consolidation within an uptrend um, in my point of view we have um, not even come down to the golden pocket to the 0 0.618 uh, fibonacci retracement level at 233 we have actually found support now at the 0 0.5 Fibonacci retracement level 284, which is normally where you find support in a bull flag. So that's all good. And from here we could set up for um, further continuation to the um, to the upside. And you know, if we see the breakout here, it will happen shortly. Actually, I mean, it's now like 11 p.m. in the UK. So in the next four hours that of next five hours, that is what the apex here would indicate that triangle. Now, these don't need to break out. Yeah, it, it's not guaranteed. They also don't need to break out to the upside, but it's a formation that you can use to, um, first of all, I think it, it shows a likelihood that we break here to the upside, um, just purely because of the moving, uh, the, the trend in the up uh, to the upside. Also, what you can watch is that, um, well, basically, I think an outbreak, outbreak, a breakout above 325 would be bullish. That would could help us to move um, then, yeah, rapidly into the to the upside, maybe to the four dollar level. Now, if we break down, that would be pretty much, yeah, it would be below three dollars. Yeah, if we if we drop below three, maybe even below 295, I think it would be below three. If we if we really drop below three, we can get to that um, 233 level, which is the 0.618 extension level is the next main support and then yeah we, we could we still have a bit of space in that triangle so we could move a few more hours um if there is no breakout then that triangle is invalid then it wasn't that one well that clearly is one but maybe it wasn't the one that was relevant here um these can also change in form over time they are sometimes subjective but in my view that could really lead us to a breakout especially because we have seemed to found the the, the low here at two, around 260, since then we've been making a higher lows again, and even a higher high here, yeah, slightly higher high, and um, since then, yeah, we, we've been making high low again. So I think we are continuing to, to trend in that triangle. I think it's bullish. I think we can expect a breakout in the next few hours. Now again, no financial advice, but I want to make you aware of breakout before it happens. So thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.